<laughs> and now we wait some more. <laughs> yeah. A poor cat is almost blind. We couldn't see his way out of the of the out of the room. Help him. Do you even see one again? I don't know. We'll see. Yeah, let's just do it again. Why not? Yeah, C one's fun. Gotta try try yeah. out some more Deuces builds. It's the one that you know is the least broken. I mean, even NH with lasers is busted. Like it's like seriously. I'm just like I just want to try something new. Why does everything have to break? Ah. <laughs> uh. I don't know what I'm doing wrong, because I have a Warhammer that could fit, like, 31 double heat sinks, but, oh, I see what my problem is. <sighs> that one extra heat sink is probably not worth two extra jets in the long run. <sighs> this will probably be the only one I do. I'm using a different build this time. <laughs> it doesn't have as many lasers, but yeah. Okay, who's the one out in the city? I kind of forgot why we don't play this game unless we're party of four. Um, it's it's event. They really should have worked on the spacing for this map. Dude, mech three is like ten times worse. Fire engaged. All right. Are we good? Well. Yeah, hopefully this map stays cool, unlike every other bloody place that's like freaking deceptively hot. Yeah, this one, I got the red line bug on quite a bit, so I decided to run only five lasers. Okay. Yeah, event, we're just shooting each other right now. Um. But Yoshi, you were mentioning Bojangles. Okay. Dangles. Saving some of my stimulus money, and when this COVID-19 thing's in, that's, I'm making a beeline to Bojangles. I've been craving with some of those biscuits. Are they considered close or takeout only? I think they might. I don't know. I don't know for sure. I'm not sure now. Because I know like the Popeyes in my area are takeout are takeout only, and some others yeah. are just order ahead. I don't know like. Uh, yes, and Al Brox Bojangles has the best biscuits, but she can attest to them. Yeah, because yeah, I had some breakfast biscuits there uh, once while on travel status. I'm going, yep, these biscuits are good. I've had so many dry biscuits, I, I just don't like them. Don't. They're not dry. Yeah, Bojangles does, does not fuck around with their biscuit quality. Horrible for you, but really good. I don't eat them all the time, it's a rare thing. Shut down sequence initiated. Dude, this is so good. Overridden. I'm not doing that Critical much damage, but like. Ow. Come on. I didn't have that much back because I turned around and uh So it was just easy pickings from there. I almost killed Yoshi with the Hellbringer. Yeah, I think it's like the gargoyles are just. Wow! Come on, I stopped firing. Don't tell me the irony is going to be when we set the temperature to normal, it's actually going to be cooler. Enemy power up. <sighs> I think that one might have been my fault, to be honest. Are we going to eight? I said nine. 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 So you disapprove, though. So it's not nine, then? So it's not eight? Well, you're right. Never mind. 
my the joke doesn't work anymore. Shutdown sequence initiated. Shutdown sequence overridden. I'm actually using an, a, a build that was inspired by this build, so I can manage a cheat very well. Stop breaking the left side of my mech very often! Yeah, sorry, I'm taking that one. I had to make up for my OH. You have to use light up because your mech blends with the background. What did you have again at both Jangles, Yoshi? Uh, one time, uh, that last instance I was talking about, it was a pair of sausage biscuits. Because they were only open for breakfast, I really couldn't get any of the lunch offerings. Zero, I mean Cyro, um, swears by Popeyes. Pretty good biscuits too. I like Bojangles a little bit though. Aww. Did I get <laughs> shot in the back again? Yes. I did all that damage and event just fired once and stole my kill. <laughs> Running a medium boat, I see. Ow. <laughs> okay. Okay, I made up some ground. No, Prox, you were already weakened, and then event, I just shot you in the back. Yeah, that's what happened. Enemy power up detected. Enemy power up detected. It's like you're standing. It's like you're able to shred my mech toe to toe. It's just that auto H. Great battery warning while I'm in the while I'm in midair. Heat level critical. Heat level critical. Heat level critical. Shutdown sequence initiated. Shutdown sequence overridden. Okay, that's fine. Ah! And event shot me in the back again. No, I actually got you that time. Oh. Yeah, my range finder's at 500. For a second, I, I thought I didn't score the last laugh. I was actually aiming for events front, but I got Yoshi's back. <laughs> yeah, my front wasn't long for the world anyway. Enemy power up
Okay, that works. Shut down, sequence I almost shut myself down. I'm glad I saw the shutdown at the bottom. event you basically have me now. For my heat. I have you have me now. <laughs> or do I have you now? No jets was engaging event, and then, and then you she just comes in guns blazing. <laughs> Shut down sequence initiated. Shut down sequence overridden. Chain fire engage. Night amplification engage. Group fire engage. Wow, event. Didn't expect that from you. Hi, Prox. Oh. Aw, oh, feels bad. <laughs> it's a shame that event OH'd before I could DFA you. <laughs> I used up all, the, all that shit, DOP. Heat level How about I get away from Yoshi? That way, you know, we can actually have a proper three-way fight. <laughs> yeah, okay, note to self, next time on Outer Volta, don't do it with a party of three. I'm on the Skyway. Yeah, I love how this thing manages heat. No. Oh my god, Event, what, what are you doing? <laughs> You're awaiting as much as I did. <laughs> I use it as a uh, medium bow. Yeah, I don't really like eight mediums. I usually stick with six or seven. Uh. I love this build. What do you put on it? Ah, uh, you decided to move at just the right moment. What are you were trying to do? Shut down sequence. 
Sequence initiated. Shutdown sequence overridden. Heat level critical. Shutdown sequence initiated. Shutdown sequence overridden. Enemy mech destroyed. Heat level critical. Shutdown sequence initiated. Shutdown sequence overridden. Enemy power up. Detected. Basically, whoever gets a gets a shot on my back wins. Figured out I can't do the grouping eight medium laser uh, alpha strikes. You have good heat man. Have to sort of keep it a chain. Mm -hmm. Destroyed. <laughs> That's all what you were doing. <laughs> well, you got me, so. Set up to eight, right? Nine. Also, I can't hear anybody. Oh, right, I turn off the bloody stream feed. Yeah, I can hear again. I couldn't hear you guys at all. Shutdown sequence overridden. I just have to tap the jets in order to let my heat gauge uh, cool all the way down. Every time I tap the jets, it just pauses. Yeah, I'm thinking next time I'll just uh, put this in a war hammer because I don't know why. I, it's like gargoyles just so easy to hit. It's not even funny. War hammers are just as easy, but they have big arms that you can actually dent. I didn't land on you correctly. Game. GG. I'll get something to eat you now. Okay. I, I swear my left torso just keeps getting shot up no matter what. <laughs> <laughs> Been a bloody running theme. <laughs> yeah. Kind of have a similar thing going on. Wow, I think MIG was on to something. Because I used, like, the 5 laser build. It, it's, it has such good heat efficiency, and its firepower is amazing. I only had two small pulse lasers, two medium lasers, and one small laser on, this, on that thing. Uh, yeah, I, I ran the 222 set. It had 28 double heat sinks, too. Five uh -huh. jets. 325XL engine. Pretty good mech. So I'm kind of thinking of making a similar build for the rifle. Then.
Oh yeah, I'm gonna have to change that too. Cause... <laughs> I technically could run a 222 build if I wanted to, but. Yeah, because my Timberwolf 222 is a 375XL, four jets, 30 double heat sinks with endo steel. I couldn't fit anything else. Oof. Hmm. I have enough criticals for another double heat sink. So. I think it's also like the downfall of the Warhammer and uh, Gargoyles that you really can't fit a 400 uh, on a 222 build. Mm -hmm. oh. Yeah, because if I try to kick it up, it goes from 11 and a quarter to 26 and a quarter. I'm going. Uh, I'm going to be making way too many concessions. Unfortunately, ah, this is Let's check the armor. armor settings 10 14 10 for back. That's good. Right, yeah, that's that works. 325XL. Save that. We got my rifleman that can actually manage its own heat. I wonder if I should do something similar with the storm crow. Because I have the, uh, oh, wow, yeah, that's way too hot. Let's change that. Delete weapon. Delete weapon. Add a double heat sink. We might be able to make this a three, uh, Might be able to make this a 330XL. Nah. Nah, maybe not. This thing is a 225. There's no... There's This thing is a 275. There's no way I can make this thing any faster. Pretty sure, anyway. Let me test it out. Yeah. Yeah, that, that's over tonnage by, like, one ton. Feels bad. Ugh. Yeah, this thing can manage its heat pretty well. Um, yeah, I just made a Warhammer. It's a 232 set. So it has a it's a 400 XL with a 29 DHSs, three jets. Yeah. I wonder if I could uh, make a 33. No, I still can't. That's unfortunate. Still have to set this thing to the standard. I was going to set it to ferrofibrous, but it was like, yeah. No. Yeah, because depending on the max, it's like either you gotta fit like sometimes I find endo steel to be a bit lighter on savings than ferro. Right. There we go. Uh, wait, what about my... Uh, okay, I don't have any of the actuators on. Good. 
I don't know why anyone would run actuators on the crow. I also love how, like, you're basically required to have case on your mech, but you don't really use it anywhere, and you just get ammo explosions anyway. <laughs> Yeah, cases are pretty much useless in this game. Yeah, it's like, you kind of don't see a need for it. At least they don't take up tonnage. Oh. Yeah, 275XL. Cool, class one, cool crow. Yeah, and I'm just putting, jamming uh, all the heat sinks I can, I can in the torso, and then. Uh... Mm -hmm. That's for the Timberwolf. Last of Enders. Honestly, I could. And I'm just putting actuators on because I'm out of room to fit other stuff. Ah, heat efficiency. So I have made a. So I have made a heat efficiency one. The only downside is, uh, it's got four chests. Yeah, I think uh, pretty much the only two, two, two uh, mech that I actually put success in is the Timberwolf because I don't have to make way too many concessions to fit it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because even though like the armor's a bit less than uh, the Gargoyle and Warhammer, I don't have to make too many concessions to fit speed. It's, right mm -hmm. now it's like uh, 30 double heat sinks with 4 jets. I'm like, oh, okay, this is pretty much uh, the best I can fit. Yeah. Yeah, because I think it's like the gargoyle can be pretty slim, and then the warhammer, it's like I'm just using the big arms, and well, I just lose all my heat sinks that way. Right. There's not much I can do. Uh, like, after that, like, I can't fit any more armor because the armor calculation's just whacked. Mm -hmm. Especially if it ends in an odd number, I'm like, you gotta be kidding me. So many sessions.